What's up YouTube, this is Square2448 with another mowing episode and today we will be using the F350 today since we used the F550 last episode so it should be a lot of fun, we'll be using the walker and like I said in the last episode we will be doing a little bit smaller properties today so we'll just turn the truck on and we'll just head on out here pull all the way out almost in the sh whoa that was not what I wanted to happen there pull all the way out into the street and turn no shut the garage door that way no one can steal our stuff come up to the light but, uh, like I've said in the past video, this map is a private map. It, I actually created this from a my blank starter map. So I created it from when it was just a flat grass field on the whole map sort of thing. So I really did put a lot of work into it. And a lot of you guys really do like it, which it's amazing that you guys like it. So like I said, I will be using this from now on. But, uh... We're going to be getting in the walker today, and the walker is a little bit smaller deck, so it might take us, like, the same time, which I hope it doesn't, since I do have another property actually planned for us today. We'll start off with mowing the front, so hopefully we could uh, get both of these properties done as efficient as possible, but if we can't, we'll do that property next episode. So, hmm, it's to right here. We mow till. So, just an amazing, amazing uh, way to like come up on the holiday, if you want to say, because we got everything working that I really have asked for for like episodes and episodes. And just, I went on and on about it, and we finally got them fixed up and done. So I'm very proud of myself, and I really want to thank the people who are helping me do all these. And out of respect, I really don't want to share their name. That way they won't get bothered by any people who w want to try to get mods fixed up. So, sorry guys. But, uh... I might, I will be uh, doing some amazing uh, holiday specials though. I believe I touched upon that in the last episode. Just really, really want to try and get a uh, different sort of like feel for the game. But one of my biggest goals uh, this Christmas break is to branch out into different games. And leading up to Christmas break actually next week I might not have a mowing I might have like a different game and give me your give me your feedback on each game tell me if you like it if you don't want to see this uh, tell me stuff like that I really really read every comment and I really do like interacting with you guys but also with interacting you guys can follow me on Twitter and just send me Twitter messages because I do post when I'm live, and I also post uh, when a video goes up. So you'll have instant uh, updates on if a video gets released. So that's pretty cool. And uh, this Applebee's is actually getting mowed really fast. So I'm really glad that this map is finally out to you guys to look at and what I mean by that is I won't be releasing this map in the meantime but it's out for you guys to watch me do some videos on but yet again it's not out to the public so keep that in mind and uh, if you're a modder and you know some stuff about maps making maps not really editing but like m making maps and like fixing the scripting uh, you guys can hit me up with a uh, comment and a message saying if you guys want to help me and then you guys will also be able to test this map but uh really really nicely done on my part for creating this amazing map for all of you 
Oh, I messed up this little piece here. But, uh, hopefully, let me check at the time. We only have this little spot left. And I said in the past video that I really want to make it as realistic as possible. And one of the biggest things is the properties won't be side by side like it has been the last ever since I created this series it's just been back to back houses like the house is right here then you go mow the next one so it's nothing like that anymore it's you load up like we're gonna do right after we mow this and we'll drive to the next property that's how it's going to be which I really do think that that's going to increase the realistic uh, part that I try to strive for in all my mowing videos so uh, really really am uh, amazed and thankful for all your support guys because it's just incredible how long this series has been around and just the changes and like the mods that I just kept editing and bringing into this map and one of them is this map like like I can't even explain how much uh, comments I got when I did that map that tour map that you guys each and every one of you who watched it and commented said amazing stuff about the map and just the positive comment comments are what make a lot of people happy so I really do thank you guys for all those nice comments but I will load up on this trailer and for a minute I'm like wait why am I getting some lag but it's really not lag because my frames are always at 60 which I really do like oh. where's the trailer the trailers over there so um there is a really big difference I would say between the two uh, dump truck versions like the one that you saw probably two episodes ago to the version that you have seen in the last and this one really really big difference in total um we're going to park I say on the side parking oh don't clip anything we'll just park over here take up all these parking spots but uh one of the weirdest things about this map is the parking spots on some of the buildings I couldn't change like these are really really small and I know that but they were stuck to the building to the point where I couldn't take them off so I just said okay we'll just have to use it the way it is sort of thing so uh, that's one of the downfalls is that some of the parking spots were stuck to the map like I believe the ones over there were but those are actually to the correct size and I then to fix that I have to take it back to sketch up and that's just a lot of work and instead of doing all that I, I could just bring in a new building which I will be doing but uh we'll just go some first person uh, zero turn mowing which uh really am a big fan of this walker I, I I believe a lot of you guys are a fan of the X marks, but uh, the, the bagger on this is a really nicely done. It's a built-in bagger, which I think is one of the best things about it. It's not like something that extends or like has like one of like the uh, I forget what they're called, but like a vacuum on like the side of the deck sort of thing. It's just like really, really nicely done and really good job by the company who made these because I really think it's a cool design and everything so yep but uh hopefully we'll get this property done and then I'm gonna be amazed that we actually got two properties done in the in the time frame that we set for the old series sort of old uh, videos but uh, I'm almost thinking that I need to increase the uh, video length so if you guys say yes to that comments in the comment in the section below ah uh, please comment on if I should increase the uh, length of these videos 
because then if we do we could probably do a little bit more mowing than we have been but uh mowing right next to that napa store that's where some people get their parts from just going to go on this side of the tree do a little bit on their side but we do mow most of these houses there's only a couple that we don't mow just going to square off this corner since it was a we were at like a turn and we'll do a couple more passes here but yeah that's gonna almost be the end of this amazing video here but uh if you guys want to see any special videos on this map or have any amazing ideas for me to record any type of video please comment below and i will give you a shout out if you guys uh can figure out some amazing videos that I could record so that that would be cool for a lot of you guys who always want a shout out Ooh. this end is always has like this turn and I really don't like it I like it like a almost like a right angle not like a curve sort of thing because then that just looks like we skipped out on that little corner there but yeah we've made a lot of progress though and it wouldn't be without a lot of your support and just putting in the comments below like great video that really does really does make me proud that I'm here making these amazing videos for you guys to watch so and a lot of YouTubers really do like the positive comments, so keep those up, guys. It really is really helpful. And, I mean, a lot of things has changed. Your feedback, like changing trucks. Actually, you guys have seen it in my tree services, and someone said change it up from the 350 long bed to uh, a different truck, but since they didn't know that I got the dump trucks working, so pretty pretty cool that we got these finally working in on the job here for us come on ramp it's one of the weirdest things about this trailer is that right there that gap which is the same gap that you would on the other on like the original trailer would just always like send these stuff flying but uh we'll just head back to the mowing area now and that's what I kind of like I really do like like driving back to it it's almost like a closure to the video instead of just ending it at the uh, place where we um, just finished mowing at but uh, one of the biggest things when I try to back in here is I try not to get the tires in the grass I don't know why, but it's kind of realistic, and I don't want to get the... Because when you drive on, like, the grass, you get, like, that dirt that you see from that one. So, uh, I really try my best not to get that. But that's going to be it for today, guys. I hope you guys are having a great holiday season, and I thank you guys for watching. You guys can share this with your friends, and uh, like always, like, comment, and subscribe.